9,000 coins, that's a lot of cheddar. Hello everyone, welcome to another video of Sneaky Sasquatch. I am your host, Black Terminator. And in this video, I will show you how you can get approximately 10,000 coins every day. This is the part 2 of my pre previous video where I have shown various ways to get 10,000 coins. But in this video, I will be covering only 3 ways by which you will get 10,000 coins. And if you are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button along with the bell icon. And don't forget to like the video. It keeps me motivated and also helps my channel to grow. Let's find a bike before going further. You will be needing it. So if you don't have one, then you can grab one either from the supermarket or the diner. I forgot to bring mine, so I am taking one from the diner. After getting the bike, let's go to the port and get some money crates. Here, I will show you a different way to get money from the port. I don't think you need to be a junior supervisor to get money from the port using this method. The only thing you need is a bike and your dog. So if you don't have a dog, get one. After entering the port, park the bike near the camera of secure location 1. Then grab your forklift and get a crate from warehouse A. Also, do let me know if this method works even if you are not a junior supervisor but before picking up the forklift it's better to rotate the cameras the cameras that you need to rotate are camera 2 6 8 and 9 Make sure your bike is not visible from this camera, else you will be in danger. After rotating the cameras, it's time to get the forklift. Make sure to avoid the cameras. Then grab a crate. Place it in front of the bike. Then you need to push the bike using the crate and forklift. This may take some time and some tries as well. So I am speeding up the process. One eternity later. So, after a lot of tries, I finally managed to push it. Great, now the bike is on the other side, which will help me in getting inside. So, this is why I was saying that you don't need to be a junior supervisor to get inside. Still, you can check and let me know. To enter inside the warehouse, I need my dog. Tommy, where are you, buddy? Oh, I missed the gate. I also have to open it to bring the forklift and Tommy inside. Now using the dog's handshake glitch, I will enter inside the warehouse. Make sure to align the dog close to the wall and then perform the handshake trick. And I'm inside the warehouse. What? Why they are not shaking hands? 
come on i don't have all day have you seen that time to get rich so let's bring the forklift and get the crates move close to the balls to avoid detection and from here drag the crates using the forklift place the crates and leave the forklift here and bring the pickup truck I left the bike inside so I have to find another vehicle or you can fast travel to race track to get the pickup truck Let's check the time first Oh it's already 8 pm I only have 1 hour to bring the pickup truck and get the crates to the construction dock Pickup truck is here. It's time for the real action. Leave the truck here and open the gate from inside. Make sure to put on the sneaky boots. Let's open the gate. Now I have to properly park the truck. Like that. The open area of the truck should be hidden. Now get into the forklift and grab the crate. But before that, I have to rotate the camera. Camera one and two. Let's get back to work. getting sleepy now drive the truck away from the port area and bring the forklift here Tommy I have to leave this crate here for the moment and unload the crate from the pickup truck bring the forklift back
and load the second crate for the pickup truck. It's time to bring the truck. But before that, let's have an energy drink. I don't want to fall asleep. How much time I have? 5 hours. Let's get back to work. Also, why I am wearing the sneaky boots? Where are my running shoes? There they are. That's better. Again, park the truck and load the crate. Bring the truck away from the port once again. Do the same for the forklift. Unload this one as well and stack it on the first one. Let's load both the crates and bring them to the construction dock. Make sure you have enough energy drinks with you. Let's see how much coins I get. Ho oh, ho, 9000 coins. So using this method I can easily get somewhere between 7 to 9000 coins per day. To get the remaining coins I have to visit the port again. Make sure you have enough energy drink with you and you can use super bike to save some time. This time I will do the night shift at the port to get additional 400 coins. Found a trespasser. Let's capture him. <laughs> Time to file a report. Trespassing in admin building. Let's do some patrolling. And get some food from the refrigerator. And have some fun with the guards. After night shift, there are still two more things that I can do to get more coins. One is the animal race, which will give me 500 coins. Here is Raccoon. Let's go for the animal race. Got 500 coins. The next thing that can be done is going to the trash fair and sell stuff. For this, I will get the beef jerky.
let's go to the trash bear. I got another 300 coins. So this is how you can get 10,000 coins per day. That's it for today guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit like, subscribe and turn on the bell icon for more awesome videos of Sneaky Sasquatch. Until then, bye.